As we As talk, we talk about, about Mwalima Julius Nyerere, Nyerere. I, want I want to tell you that, that this, this man is a challenge, challenge in today's Africa. Africa. Today, today we, we have, have a crisis, crisis of leadership, leadership in our, our continent. continent. I'm sure, I'm sure you're, you're not, not going, going to doubt it. it. Quite, Quite often, often we, we try, try to, to either, either wish, wish away, away or, or divert, divert attention, attention from our, our problems, problems by, by maybe, maybe justifiably also, also calling, calling the foreigners, foreigners who might have caused cause our problems. problems. We, we invoke, invoke slave, slave trade, trade and slavery. slavery. We, we invoke, invoke colonialism, colonialism as, as things, things that, that have kept, kept us where we are. are. Maybe, Maybe they have. have. But let, 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 let us, us just do a little, little introspection, introspection, which I'm, which I'm sure, sure is what, what um, um, Julius Nyerere did. did. There, there is hardly any, any country, country in the world, world any people, people that have that not had some experience of slavery. Of slavery. Any, any people, people that, that have, have not, not had, had some, some experience, experience of colonialism. colonialism. If, if you think, think of the time, the time we talked of, of the reign of the, of the two, two Napolis, even, even this, this country, country Italy, Italy, has, has had, had its own experience, experience of colonialism. colonialism. You, you go, go to, to the various, various countries, countries in Europe, Europe. You, you think, think of, of even, even the great Israel, Israel as, As we, we think, think of today, today you, only you only need to, to open, open the pages, pages of the Bible. Bible. They, they have, have experience also. But, but they, they did not, not dwell in licking their, their wounds, wounds and, and blaming, blaming others. others. They, they tried try to come, come home and do and introspection and say, we, we don't want to make the mistakes others have made us to make. Or, or others have made, made in us. us. You know, you know what, what we have, we have today? today? In, in Africa? Africa? We, we criticize, criticize colonialism, 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 but what, what we, have, we have? We have an, an inculturation of colonialism. We bring, we bring colonialism, colonialism home. home. Some, Some people, people call, call it ethnocentrism. ethnocentrism. Others, others call, call it tribalism. tribalism. Tell me, we, we go, go to some, to some places, places and we are, we are worried, worried about, about the, people the people that propagate, that propagate white, white supremacy, supremacy concepts. concepts. And, and we, we come, come back, back to Africa, Africa we, we have, have ethnic, ethnic supremacy, supremacy, tribal supremacy. supremacy. One, One tribe, tribe is feeling it is superior, superior to the others. others. Maybe, Maybe because, because it is lucky to have, to have more, more people that have got titles. titles. Is that not what we have gotten from the others? Or one, or one tribe, tribe gets, gets the power, the power and, and then, then it uses, uses the power to oppress another, another tribe, tribe or other tribes. tribes. Is that not, not colonialism? colonialism? Why, Why do we, we bring, bring it home? home? Why, Why then do we, we keep to blame, blame, blame others? Now, now where, where does Mwalim Julius Nyerere stand out? We look we around Africa. Africa. There, there is hardly any, any country, country in the, con in the continent that doesn't have acute problems, problems of ethnocentric prejudice, ethnocentric, prejudice, ethnocentric discrimination. discrimination. I, can I can tell you this because, because I am the secretary of the Dicastery for Evangelization, precisely the section that deals with first evangelization and the new young Local, local churches. churches. Our, Our dicastery is, is the extended arm of the Pope, Pope in ex uh, dealing with relationship with the local, local churches, churches, in making, making provision, provision for the churches, churches helping the Pope, Pope advising him, him on, on who becomes, becomes bishop and, and where. where. And, and I can, can tell, tell you, you we, we have, have problems, problems in the naming of bishops in most of our African countries. countries. Oh, he, oh, he is, is not, not from our tribe. tribe. He is not, not going, going to be accepted. Be accepted. Oh, he, he is, is not, not from, from that type, that, that area. area. He is not, not going, going to be accepted. Be accepted. Instead, Instead of, of accepting him, him we, we prefer, prefer the priest from, from Europe. Europe. 
we prefer Europeans to our own brothers who are from other ethnic groups. Is that not racism uh, inculturated? Now, Mwalima, Mwalimu Julius Nyerere was able to focus on uniting his people. That is one place when we are making the provision for a bishop, the least worry for us is which is his ethnic group, where is he coming from, which is his tribe. And that is because of Julius Nyerere. As a president, his focus was not on how big, how fat his bank account is somewhere in Europe. His, his emphasis, emphasis was, was not, not on how, how many, many big or his fleet of cars. cars. No. no. His, his focus was on Ujamaa. How, how can, can we, we be together, brother? Brothers and sisters. In this, he already had the foresight, leaving out already what Pope Francis would write in the encyclical Fratelli Tutti, taking the example from Francis of Assisi, who sees in everybody a brother and a sister. And in his life also, Julius Nyerere put into practice the thing that St. Paul gives us. We remember his letter to the Ephesians. If you open your Bible, Ephesians chapter 2, from verse 13 to verse 20. In verse 13, he tells us that those who were far off have not become near. With the blood of Christ, that broke down the walls, dividing walls, making us one people. And then in verse 19, precisely he says, you are no longer strangers, but fellow citizens in the same household, the family, that has got the apostles as its foundation, with Jesus Christ as a cornerstone. Mualimu Julius Nyerere lived according to the spirit of the word of God in the New Testament and according to the spirit that we find in that beautiful encyclical of Pope Francis, Fratelli Tutti, on social, international fraternity. May all our other African presidents and leaders today take the leaf from him and not focus on their, their own, own personal, personal enrichment, enrichment material, material enrichment, enrichment, not focus on favoritism towards their, their own ethnic, ethnic groups, groups, but on the universal fraternity, brotherhood, and sisterhood that should characterize people that profess the church as family of God. Thank, Thank you for inviting us.